Hello, today I'll be showing you guys how I like to play Nova. Uh, I just bought Nova maybe a month ago, and so I'm still new to her, but this was one of my games that I played, and I think I did pretty well, so I'm just going to show you guys my thought process on how I play. I generally just like to stalk my enemies and target the weak ones. That's pretty much it. I think with Nova, you usually, or what I've done is go behind enemy lines while I'm cloaked uh, and and basically just gank them. Got some health there. This was a new map uh, which was pretty cool. Um, I wasn't really sure what you were supposed to do on this map but what I found was a good tactic with Nova was to try to pick off people who were attacking my champion because usually they would be at a lower health uh, and so later on in the game I, I, I tried doing that but I'm running away from that Chen there because he's very tanky and again with Nova from my experience I only target uh, the squishy ones and here you can see we had a very positive Illidan who was discouraged the entire game uh, very early on convinced that we were gonna lose and that didn't really make for a good team dynamic but I guess that's common in any sort of MMO yeah he's pretty much accusing us of being really bad and that he's just gonna be AFK for the rest of the game so that was nice at this point I'm thinking we're fucked but might as well just keep playing. I'm not really sure what I was doing there. I think I was considering getting more mana. But I figured, fuck it, let's just go. So at this stage, this is my very first time playing this map, so I really have no idea what we're supposed to do with these heroes. Uh, and then we have our Illidan just yelling at people on our team, so that was nice. Um, but here we were able to burst down their enemy Illidan, which is pretty cool. And I think slowly uh, the tide started churning here. Oh, and our Tassadar got away, or no he didn't. So I think here I'm gonna go try to gank them from the back again. And let's see how, let's see how this goes. So... Yeah, not not really effective at all. Usually when I'm running, I'll lay down a hologram, and sometimes they'll take the bait. Uh, but they're if, if they're more a more advanced player, then they'll know that they should not target me, or that they shouldn't target the hologram. I do like to hide in the bushes to regain my stealth, and what I found is that it's very hard to detect Nova, um, Nova's cloak when she's in the bush so when you're walking around it's pretty easy to spot but when you're actually hiding in a bush it's pretty hard to detect her hiding there so it looks like we're down a level and we're getting pushed pretty hard still in the game blue team hero killed I'm not really sure what that means I guess it just means one of their heroes were killed. I'm not sure. Alright, so... Not really... Okay. Engaging the Illidan. Still don't have my ultimate yet. And in terms of the masteries that I like to select with Nova is I usually get the one that just increases the power of the shot while cloaked and also increases ability power. Basically anything to just get her to deal more damage. I usually don't do the other ones. I think there's a slow ability 
and something that lets her move more quickly while she's cloaked, I really don't do that. And here again we see our Illidan encouraging our team members that we still have hope. Not really, I'm being sarcastic there. But we do, we do start coming back. There's the Chen, I laid the decoy and it threw him off for a little bit. And our Zagara just got taken down. This isn't looking very good for us. And I think we just flee. And with Nova, after a certain amount of time, her cloak automatically resets. And so here I'm just in, in the bushes and I don't think they know where I went. So again, this is a tactic that seems to work pretty well with Nova. And here I'm not sure why I decided to try to go for the Chen. Let's see how that... Yeah, that did not end well. <laughs> so 9 to 7. We're definitely not doing that well. Uh, let's see what else is going on here. They got the Immortal again. They're pushing us. Zagara is actually doing really well, dealing tons of damage. Um, but yeah, this doesn't look very promising for us. Okay, it looks like I've respawned. So let's see what let's see what Nova can do here. All right, I guess I decide here just to go straight on and try to push him back. Alright, I put that down, hoping that they would take the bait with the hallucination, but that didn't really do much. I'm looking at, thinking of targeting that Chen because he looks pretty low. And this is just not... Okay, see, there again I laid down that hologram, hope, hoping that they would take the bait. And someone's alting here, I'm not really sure what's happening. Uh, Zagara and I though, just trying to hold the fort, and I'm not sure what Illidan is doing at this point, maybe he's AFK, and the Cyber, I don't really understand that champion, so, um, I'm not sure what I'm doing here. Okay, trying to go in for the gank, going past them, let's see if, let's see if I can do anything here. Okay, now I decide to run. I should be targeting that Illidan, he's pretty low. Okay, I'm ulting him. That was pretty good. Running again. Pretty much a hit and run uh, with uh, Nova here. And I'm basically being hunted down, but uh, sometimes here... So here I'm... Oh, that wasn't good. What I was trying to do there was just to freeze, and I think in some cases that does con tend to confuse people if you just stay in place. Uh, it's less noticeable what you're where you are when you're stealthed. So that's what I was trying to do there. A little bit of recall here. Let's see what else is going on. Zagara here wants to get this camp. And our Illidan is saying he's gonna solo. That's nice. And these guys are just pushing together. Staying uh, together as a team. That's pretty good. And looks like we get this camp pretty w well. Uh oh, Zagara is going to be in trouble. Let's see how this goes. All right, so lay down the hologram, trying to save Zagara here, trying to uh, uh, just distract Illidan. Uh, don't do a good job at all of saving Zagara. That was pretty cowardly of, you, of me. Um, but let's see what we can do here. Okay, so I look. That Nazebo looks pretty weak. Hopefully I could burst him down. Oh uh, no, I'm really not doing much. <laughs> Alright, so... So here's where everyone seems to be fighting the um, Immortal. So I'm hoping that I can pick a couple of them off. But, okay, looks like I've targeted one guy. Oh, I got the Zagara. Nice. Alright, so... Not sure where I'm going now. Oh, 
I'm trying. Oh, I think we just killed an Illidan. Okay. So, looks like I'm roaming. Oh, I'm gonna try to destroy this immortal, help my team out a little bit here. And Zagara doing tons of damage with those Banelings. At this point I'm finally kind of getting the hang of this map and contributing more to killing the immortals, so um, that was good. And another engagement here. I'm pretty much low on mana at this point, so I don't know how much I can contribute here. Um, let's see what's going on. Yeah, I'm going back. Let's see how the rest of my team is doing here. Yeah, that Illidan's dead. And Zagara is trying to help him. And here... Here we can see our Illidan going crazy again. And... Here I am... Going to the place where our Illidan died. And... Ah, oh, that was just a fail. That was just a fail shot right there. I tried to uh, cue Illidan, but I totally missed. So I'm trying to stay behind enemy lines here. And hopefully thinking I can pick someone off. Uh, targeting that Illidan, he's gone. And I laid down that hallucination again to try to trick people. And targeting that Nazebo now. And I wasn't able to burst down the Nazebo and it looks like I'm dead here. Oh! No. I barely dodged whatever the hell that guy was trying to shoot at me. And I'm back for help. But uh, we're barely hanging in there. Trying to kill. Hopefully, we can kill that Chen. Alright, I'm coming back. Alright, looks like we killed the Chen. And uh, hopefully, I can kill the Zagara here. And then Mazebo. So they overextended themselves there. That was good. That helped us get a uh, level. Uh, yeah, 15 to 15, so we're on the same level now. So I think we're gaining a little bit more teamwork now. Uh, we're listening to our fearless leader, Illidan. And uh, we're gonna, we're gonna try to kill this immortal now. I'm not sure what's going down here. Oh, looks like he killed this tribe. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to take this um, immortal down. Not sure why I threw my hallucination down there. Well, sometimes what I like to do is throw in the hallucination into the bruiser camps, and that attracts the enemies to attack them, um, saving my teammates from getting hit, so. I think that's what I was trying to do there. And uh looks like we're doing pretty well here. We're about to get we're about to fight the enemy here. And oh, I'm going in for that Nazebo. Let's see if I could take him down. Chen tried to cover him, but I was he was able he went down. And then that's a pretty good ult from Zagara. Hopefully we can take down that Odin. And our Illidan calling it good game. And hopefully... It's too bad we didn't get that Illidan. Well, maybe we can kill Chen here. Oh man, I just don't have enough mana. There we go. Stop focusing the Chen. <laughs> Alright. God damn it. <laughs> So Zagara and I here are doing pretty well despite being 
scolded by our leader. Oh. And I'm not really sure what that is. So I think I'm about to run here. Zagara is killing killed by Illidan and I'm able to save him which is nice. So Zagara being one of my more friendlier teammates thanking me. That was nice of him. Something going on here. Um, again, our Illidan very positive. Our um, our immortal is pushing, but we just couldn't respawn enough, respawn in time to to push with our immortal. So that was a little less than ideal, but still okay. Our Illidan going in for the kill, and I think he might have. Oh no, he's still in there. I threw in a little hallucination to absorb some hits and Zagara's ulting and I'm trying to kill that guy Nazebo. he goes down Chen's gonna go down hopefully okay Nazebo, this Nazebo hopefully he's not gonna go down but is looking pretty low Illidan comes in and kills him I think I'm still trying to do something but he's gonna come in and kill me and Tassadar uh, he's probably gonna get killed here too. Oh man, he totally went behind him as he tried to size storm him. So pretty evenly matched right now, although we do have the lead in terms of level, so that was pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this siege camp, and we are still respawning, and this is at the 16 minute mark. So pretty close game. We're, we're doing a little bit better late game, getting our act together. They were doing a little bit better early game, so it's a good it's a good match. Here's our Illidan again, going solo, trying to trying to go three v one against this, and that's just not going to work. And here he is just he's just angry. He's just an angry man. He says every time he goes for a camp he has no help and we're a shitty team but clearly he could see we were all respawning so I'm not really sure what he's talking about <laughs> and our Tassadar here saying he complains a lot Alright, so uh, hopefully, yeah, I'm gonna alt that Illidan. So, um, the alting with Nova that I like to use is called Triple Tap, and what that does is uh, it targets, it has a pretty good range, and it targets a singular unit, a, a champion, and um, you basically get to shoot him three times automatically, um, and it, it does enough damage to kill most squishy champions um, but you can you can use other champions to block the hits so someone can tank that hit for you and here's a big battle but we have the edge here 4v2 thrown in a hallucination and yeah they just got destroyed there so we, we have the edge on in terms of uh, our level and the tide seems to be churning here and yeah, we're just we're just coming back, dodging these little little bombs. All right, it's pretty good. And I'm. I'm saying here, let's tick to tether. Let's stick together. And I wasn't able to kill this Illidan in time um, to save our Illidan, which I believe prompts a rage here. I had to actually alt that Illidan because he kept moving so fast. Alright, so we're pushing with our Immortal, doing pretty well. I'm 
Zagara's destroying them with their banglings and here I ult that Zagara and he goes down and at this point I think I have the ability that um, reduces or eliminates my cooldown if I kill an enemy with my with my ultimate so that's really good all right I don't know what I'm doing here I think I'm just being indecisive but we have two levels up now so we're looking pretty good I'm just gonna escape here and I think this is a Hydralisk from Cybar? I really don't know um, but that Hydralisk is, is pretty strong because this is this is Cybar so I really don't know what he does but I think he he sieges quite well so here we are again I'm just with my homie here Zagara and uh okay this i believe is the first time we're helping our illidan uh, take down this siege camp all right and here's another battle but they only have two people so let's see what happens where am i oh i'm just hiding here okay and i went in for the alt there that nazebo's dead chen's coming after me i throw in a hallucination he's not falling for it but he does actually i'm coming looping around on here Two of them died, and the Chen's peeling off here. I'm trying to get behind them. I'm gonna go for this Zagara. Oh, I guess the Chen. And I am playing pretty conservatively. And I'm going in for the Chen, seeing that he has low damage, low health. Um, and I'm gonna try to kill this Zagara too, but it, he had too high of health for him to be bursted down by the triple tap alt. So we're in a pretty good position I think right now. Three of them down, we're all alive. Um, I guess it helped that their Illidan was just soloing up top. So we got the advantage. And um, yeah, we're just gonna push at this point. So it looks like we're gonna go back for the immortal and um yeah they're just pushing they're going for their immortal their illidan luckily we have good teamwork going on here Zagara's getting the siege camp they're coming back and Azebo's coming in he's gonna try to take us down but our Ill illidan's going after him. I'm just trying to burst down this immortal but I'm about to die. Um, two enemies up top and uh, I'm just gonna... I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just trying to stick with my team and stay low. Nova being very very weak or I guess very squishy. I usually I don't want to engage anybody uh, when I have pretty low health, unless I know I can just quickly kill them off um, by alting them or ganking them. So I believe I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna go back for now and. Um, Yeah, it looks like we're all up top and they're all at the bottom. So I think at this point it's going to be a base race. We have the Immortal on our side and they're just going in. And I'm trying to communicate their B pushing race, which that just made no sense. So I decided to go back and uh, try to help my because I'm not, I don't really do a siege damage, so I'm just gonna try to alt people. So I was able to take him down. And uh, I'm gonna target this Illidan because I think I could take him down as well, but I guess I decide to shoot him and game, good game, it's over. Our team's done it. So that was pretty much um, a game I felt uh, I played okay in and we had a good comeback 
in spite of our uh, somewhat negative team members, and I really enjoy playing Nova, so I hope this was maybe somewhat helpful for you guys out there, and um, yeah, hopefully I can continue to make more videos, and I hope you have a nice day.